welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today we're just going to be doing a little makeup routine. It's my everyday makeup routine. I'm also going to be doing some skincare as well. So if you're interested in seeing what my skincare and everyday makeup routine is, then just keep on watching. So when I start with my makeup routine, I always just rinse my face off with cold water. I read that that helps close your pores, so then the makeup won't actually like seep into your pores. I don't know if that's true, but I do it. Next, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to be using um, this moisturizer here, it's by Clinique. I got it in Ulta, and I really enjoy it. I have combination skin so I get oily but I also have dry patches and I have dry patches where I have the oil which is really annoying but I just go kind of just in my t-zone and then bring it out I also have my mirror right here to my side so if you see me looking at that that's what I'm looking at I use this Clinique moisture the Clinique Moisture Surge. It's more of like a gel. It feels really nice, especially when it's cold. I wanna get one of those like mini refrigerators where you can put your like skincare in. But I don't know about that. So I just gotta put that all around my face, especially around my nose because that's probably where I get the driest. And excuse that. I am really bad at picking out my face. So. Okay, and then once I'm done with that, I either take this Mario Badescu facial spray or this one. They're practically the same thing. So I just do that. And that definitely wakes me up for the morning. It feels so nice. So once I'm done with my skincare routine, I'm going to take the Too Faced Multi Sculpting Concealer and then I just put this underneath my eye on top of my eyelid and then I will spot conceal a little bit. I also have some scarring that I like to cover up and then I will also take the foundation and what I've been using is the IT Cosmetics CC Cream. I will just take a little bit of this on my fingertip. That's a little too much actually. And then for my face, I will just kind of put this over on top of that concealer that I spot concealed just to help it blend a little bit because the concealer is much lighter than my face. So then I'm going to blend out. I just really don't like the way my eyes look without putting concealer under them. I just really like the... Anyway. I just really enjoy the brightened under eye. I know this looks scary right now, but trust me, it will get better. Or it won't, and I'll look crazy, but if I like it, I like it. It's all that matters, right? So this is essentially makeup that I would wear to work on a daily basis. Sometimes I will wear foundation to work but I recently have really been trying not to because it's kind of just a waste in a way I mean I like to look presentable but also nobody really cares so I shouldn't so then once I have that all blended in I take the Laura Mercier loose setting powder and then I'm going to set my under eyes And then I'm going to set all around where I put that concealer as well because after this I'm going to put putting bronzer on my face and I don't want the bronzer to cling to those spots where I haven't fully where they haven't fully dried yet and I've noticed a big difference doing that 
sometimes like on my cheeks I'll randomly get these blotchy marks and it looks muddy and I it bothers the crap out of me especially when I get into work and I see it and I'm like great well looks like I have mud on my face for the day and then I'll just kind of take the remainder of the setting powder and kind of just blot it over my entire face just to help my face dry a little bit more do you guys hear anything in the bathroom it's mason <laughs> he's kind of just roaming around we went to the dog park this morning and there were a couple dogs there he played with but didn't play for a, a crazy amount of time so once i am done setting my face I'm going to be using the Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer. This bronzer smells absolutely amazing. And I'm just going to be using this brush that I got in BoxyCharm a few months ago. So then I'm just going to be going around my entire face because my face is lighter than my body. So I like to match that. I have been putting bronzer all over my face since I was in middle school probably. I just like to even out my face and then I put some over my eyes as well just so it doesn't look too bright and like too fake you know what I mean and then I'm just going to kind of focus more of that bronzer on my cheekbones because your girl doesn't have any definition on her face she has chubby cheeks and a couple double chins, so I try to make it work. Once I'm done with bronzer, I will use blush. I'm going to be using the Lorac Rose Blush, I guess. I got this at Ulta and I really enjoy it. It doesn't have any glitter in it, which I really like. I do not like blushes with glitter in them. So this one just works out really well. I kind of go up my forehead and then around. All the YouTube videos that I've watched, I've learned that you kind of want to make everything coincide together. You don't want to really see, oh, that's where your bronzer starts, that's where your blush starts, that's where your highlight starts. You kind of want to mesh it all into one, at least the YouTubers that I watch. And I've noticed that it just like looks more natural. Even if people can tell you're wearing makeup, it's just something that it just looks better. So then I'm going to take my bronzer brush again and then I'm just kind of going to bring everything together so there are no harsh lines. So I'm going to be using the Better Than Sex mascara. I really enjoy this mascara. I've been using it for a few years now. I got eyelash extensions probably a year ago maybe more maybe a little less and I really enjoyed them the girl that did them for me did such a nice job she was so sweet and I would love to go back and get them done again but for a full set it's $150 and right now I do not have that kind of money to just spend on eyelashes I'm not good at putting falsies on, so I just felt like the eyelash extensions kind of just made me a little bit more confident, and um, sometimes I really don't like putting mascara on. I just felt like it made my eyes look better, and I could just not really wear much makeup. The one thing I don't enjoy about this mascara is that it does dry up so fast. Like, you can use it three times and it will start getting dry, and that's frustrating. And then I'm just going to use my Anastasia Brow Wiz. I'm going to just go through my eyebrows. I don't really do much to my eyebrows anyway because I'm not good at my eyebrows either. And I really want to get them threaded. I would really actually enjoy getting them microbladed. Well, I wouldn't enjoy getting them microbladed, but I would like to get my eyebrows microbladed. But sometimes I'll just go up to the top and kind of just make a little bit more of an angle so they're just not as rounded. I really don't do much with my eyebrows just because I don't really know what to do with them. And then I'm gonna just take my Benefit Gimme Brow. Run. 
So on a day that I would work, I would not do my eyebrows at all. I just kind of felt like doing them today. I sometimes will if like it's a weekend and Nate and I are going to do something and I don't feel like doing full, full face with foundation and whatnot. If I want to still look nice, I'll do my eyebrows. So this is my completed look for my everyday makeup routine. Sometimes I will put in some top eyeliner, just normal black eyeliner. Um, I don't set my face usually. If I do, it will be the Morphe Continuous Setting Spray, but I'm running low, so I'm trying to avoid using it. But if you guys want to see a full face of makeup with foundation, eyeshadow, eyelashes, all that, just leave a comment down below and I would love to do that for you guys. So that's it for today's video. If you guys like seeing this, want more videos, please subscribe to my YouTube channel and leave some comments down below so I can give you guys what you'd like. All right, thank you, bye.